Hi, my name is Michael Hall. I'm from Racine, Wisconsin, and I played at Ottawa, Arizona University, and I play kicker and punter. I'm 180 pounds, and I stand six foot tall. 2021 for me was the year of the goals. I had tons of them. I set goals at every single phase of the season, every single minute, every single hour, every single day, every single week, etc. You know, I was just constantly, constantly, constantly setting goals. And my main objective was to remain accountable and consistent. How do I think I took advantage of the extra time that I had in college due to COVID? Well, my eligibility clock when I ran out, you know, I went to the military right after high school. And when I left the military, I really didn't have any direction for my life. I only played one year of high school. And, you know, like for me, football was kind of, you know, like a whisper in the wind, like it never really didn't think like it was going to amount to anything. And once I really started taking it serious and perfecting my craft, that's when everything just, you know, made a lot more sense. And it just made me really realize that this is my main calling right here. It's kicking the ball. I feel like if my coaches and my teammates would describe my game, they would describe it as ferocious. They would describe it as aggressive. They would describe it as hungry. The main thing that they would describe it as is determination. Simple for the fact that I want the ball in my hands, or a ball in my foot, so to speak. I want it to come down to me. The main takeaways that I get from studying film is my body position and my form and fundamentals. The way that I approach the ball, the way that I step, the speed in which I step to the ball, all that is so, so important. Separates me from other pro prospects is just my raw determination for my goals. I've been through so many things, trying to chase this dream and trying to perfect my craft. And my hunger and my thirst for success is it's unlike any other. And I think that anybody who watched me see me play and sees me on the sidelines, even when I'm not even in the game, they can just feel that I love what I do. I love kicking the ball. And I want to be there. I want to be on the field. I haven't been playing this game for a long time, not for a long point in my life, but, you know, just being an athlete the whole entire time in my life, it just made me a gamer. And I just. I just love sports, and I just love working hard. And I just really just want to be known as a hard worker and just as a good person. And, you know, I feel like football is that avenue in life, you know, and I've been down many avenues of life. I've been a veteran, um, you know, I've worked at McDonald's, you know, done a bunch of different jobs, you know. But I truly feel with kicking, you know, it gives me a chance to come and save the day in a way that, you know, is truly fitting for me. The strengths that I would bring to a team on and off the field is one, pure raw strength from the kicking position. My abilities with not just my feet, but my hands and the whole rest of my body is unlike none. I'm an explosive athlete, I'm not just a kicker. And I'm able to make plays. And so if the play breaks down, I'm able to get a tackle. If need to, I'm able to run a fake. And off the field, you know, I just have a love for just being able to, you know, share my story and affect people and inspire others and, um, I know the NFL and other professional leagues, they have a lot of charity work and stuff, and I really want to be a part of that and help not only the kicking community, but, you know, football as a whole, you know, football is its own, like, little ecosystem, and, you know, I really want to help people, you know, through football somehow. If I uh, was to give a pitch to the NFL and other pro leagues, you know, just it just be, please, you know, please examine the past six years. Please put me under the microscope. Please test me. 
Please allow me the opportunity to prove to you who I am. And please take time to understand the story that is my call. Because it's an amazing story. And it's only going to keep on getting better.